everyone, it's Emily from The Pinning Mama. If you are on YouTube, hop on over to the blog. It is www.thepinningmama.com. You'll find the whole post for this tutorial on that blog. Um, well, welcome to Silhouette Bootcamp Lesson 26. Today we are learning all about the overcut feature. Last week we learned about cut, all about different cut lines. Um, so let's get started. Overcut is a feature used to take your design and cut it a little bit outside of the lines. Um, my little guy wanted a these Beyblade. He loves Beyblades, and so he wanted me to cut out a Beyblade design for him. Um, so I decided I pulled these off of Silhouette over here in the shapes, um, and then I pulled them down, made them the size I wanted, um, and I'm going to use the overcut feature to make sure I don't miss any of these sharp, sharp lines that I have right here. Once you have your design to the size of your liking, you then go over here and you're going to use the overcut feature. The overcut feature is over here in send. Remember the biggest thing for the overcut feature is it only works for sharp lines. And it's over here in the send tab. You got to give the computer a second to catch up. In this tab, while we're waiting for my computer, there it goes. In this tab, you'll find a triangle and a square and then three dots. Right here, you want to click on those dots. And you want to right here where it says line segment overcut, click that box. And if you notice when I hit overcut, you'll see that space right here. All that space, and you can do bigger or smaller. You can change the width of it. All that space is going to make it so when the design gets cut in silhouette, you can overcut over the lines and so you can get sharper edges instead of missing part of your design. Make sure after you check the box and you decide how big the width you want your overcut, you to go over here and hit save as. That'll save your design. So when you go to cut this in silhouette, it'll cut the overcut feature. This feature works once again best for thick or denser material. If you're cutting really sharp edges or really block, blocky type fonts. So thick, denser material, sharp edges or block fonts is what this feature works for. It will not work at all on rounded edges. It won't even pick it up. Um, and so that's all I have for you in this quick tutorial on using Overcut. Um, tune in next week to learn all about image effect in Silhouette Studio. Thanks, guys.